Ever wondered what is affecting marine life? I'm not talking about pollution or rising water temperatures. I'm talking about ocean acidification. Ocean acidification is the decrease in pH levels due to the rising atmospheric carbon dioxide levels. This is a serious threat to marine ecosystems. Ocean acidification either has a negative or neutral effect on most marine animals. The Industrial Revolution caused CO2 to be released from activities such as burning fossil fuels, which has led to the increase of the carbon dioxide concentration in seawater. This results in a decrease in acidic levels, affecting many marine animals and ecosystems. Ocean acidification can be found affecting the juvenile red king crabs and the tanner crabs. The condition, survival, calcification and growth of these particular crabs were determined by experiments involving different temperatures and pH levels. One experiment was done by rearing the crabs separately at various pH levels and at an ambient temperature for a period of time. It was found that the survival rate in both species decreased with pH. The calcium concentration was measured in each crab at the end of this experiment. It was found that both species were affected by the acidified water itself, but did not grow slower in this water. This graph depicts the growth of the red king crab in controlled and pH 7.8 water. Graph A is the carapace length, and graph B is the wet mass of the crab. The dots represent individual measurements. measurements. Because the temperature was not controlled, the condition the crabs were exposed to is similar to their natural conditions. This next graph presents the survival of crabs in control and acidified water. The red king crab, graph A, and the tanner crab, graph B, were placed in controlled treatment tanks over the duration of the experiment. By the end of the experiment, the graph states that the crabs in controlled water was a 61% high mass than crabs in pH 7.8 water. As the survival rate for these crabs decrease, there is a high chance to have a negative effect on their populations in the absence of evolutionary adaptation and colonization in the future. These experiments will aid scientists to correctly predict the effects that ocean acidification not only has on these crabs, but majority of marine life. The future research should consist of deeper understanding of the effects and penalties of ocean acidification at all life stages for these species of crabs on their interactions with acidified conditions. Another future experiment should be exposing the animals to the pHs that vary seasonally to determine how purity in pH affects survival. I hope you now know how ocean acidification is affecting our environment. Thank you for listening.